specific question about NWA alumni that right now is just at a meteoric rise in the WWE. And I'm curious if you two ever crossed paths. LA Knight, any thoughts on LA Knight? Perfect example. Yeah. Pigeonholed into a a character or a place or a, you can do this, but you can't do that. Like that was the big thing, right? Oh, you're 40. Well, yeah. He's mad. Like most of the top guys, if you're looking at it, most of the top guys that draw money are forties or in their forties. Almost all the main eventers are in their forties now, but it's like, Danger. you get sitting there like, well, maybe you should be an announcer or maybe you should be this, you know what I mean? And it's like, they did that same thing with all of this too. But yeah, man, LA Knight, hell of a good worker. I've known him for a long time, man. I, I forget running into people over the years. It kind of it kind of sucks. But it's like I did uh mocap for the video game. Like when it oh. pitched, like in the set, like and they do all that stuff. I was doing all the yes. super heavy, I was doing the super heavy moves. So uh it was like it was me and, and LA Knight and Swerve. Um Strictly. Oh yeah, so Swerve was there, and they're like I can't remember who else. Like a couple other guys, like Micah Taylor or something like that. And uh, I was, it was the first time getting to spend a lot of time with them, like in a one-on-one situation. Like besides doing some trainings and stuff like that, which you know is what mm-hmm. I do. Like when you're training, if you're in the zone, you're not like, eh, blah, blah, blah. you're like you're trying to learn and you're yeah. trying to do your thing, and it's like. Sometimes you connect with guys right away and sometimes sometimes you don't. And sometimes you don't know that you connect with them until you ride in a car with them for eight hours. And like, so, you know, we weren't, we never kicked it or hung out or nothing. And I was sitting there just watching him go through those moves. And it was like, all right, we need somebody to do so cold. And it was him. Hey, we need somebody to do like freaking call, go beware. Him, somebody there, him, somebody else, him. Wow. Next on Jim Duggan, me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jim Duggan, me, Stan Hansen, me, who else? Bundy, Andre, Luke Gallows, which I love because he's my best friend in the whole wide world. Oh, uh, shoot. I got to do all his crappy moves on there. So if his moves <laughs> kind of low or slow, it's that. <laughs> <laughs> that's so awesome. Yeah, man, that's the thing about the game. It's always evolving. Rewind, recap, relive. For over 50 episodes, the revolutionary force in wrestling interviews.